Good morning from Niagara Falls. It's a beautiful day out here in Ottawa. Apparently it's going to be cold. Luckily we haven't moved our office yet. Well, today we have some pretty good business. Some big news is the conservative motion, the health motion has passed. Okay, so first thing we have here uh, in the House of Commons, Bill C-6, which is to amend conversion therapy, and Bill C-7, which is medical assistance in dying. These two bills will be discussed in their readings. Next, we have the Prime Minister will be doing another um, 11.30 a.m., you know, with meetings and stuff with social children. You can see all that. Uh, he will attend question period. And also in the morning, it looks like he's doing more campaigning. So, um, you know, this thing, but it looks like, you know, the children and family thing, it looks like a pretty good meeting he's going to have in the morning. It's going to be all good. But it feels like he's a little bit on campaign mode with a lot of this. I don't know. Leave your comments below about that. But again, the conservative motion has passed. So they're going to be able to look into the health spending on COVID and all that jazz now the committees we have a uh, oodles of them first we have um Ainan, indigenous northern affairs then we have justin and humans justice and human rights of course procedure and house affairs proc we'll be looking at that um status of women we haven't actually i haven't watched that one uh veterans affairs we'll check it out today veterans affairs of course is always a key one of those vets here and citizenship and immigration subcommittee on international human rights of course will be uh, that's that's uh, you know we'll look at that and of course again and then at eight and then i have another one later on today well let's hope that uh, the mps find a solution to this because the fires the burnings the um fishermen losing you know it's just all bad hopefully they find a solution leave your comments below on what you think the solution is always have a good day.